if you're looking for a two-bedroom unit that's in the core central region and it's under $1.7 million. You've got to watch this video. Hi guys, this is Jervis and welcome to an episode of GNA Unlocked. All right, welcome to this apartment. I am so excited to show you throughout this entire apartment today because I'll be the only home tour presenter and I can finally bring you through the bedrooms, okay? So where I'm standing on right now is actually on the 12th floor of 6 Shire. This is a 732 square foot apartment, two bedroom, two bathroom, and the owners have spent close to $60,000 in renovating this entire space to feed the modern luxury team. Where I'm standing on right now is actually where the open concept kitchen is. And as you can see, everything looks brand new. This is because this development is actually very new and the owners also have done a great job in maintaining. The only thing that owners have changed is actually this uh, kitchen top over here. They have changed it into a quartz top and it's made of South Stone, which is a top-notch brand. And as you can see, this kitchen here is very functional for a 732 square foot apartment. You have plenty of cabinetry spaces as you can see. You have the cooker hood, a cooker hob, and you also have an induction cooker right here. And what I love about apartments in the core central region is that most of the appliances here are made of top-notch brands, right? So everything from the cooker hood, the cooker hob, all the way to the washer and dryer, the built-in microwave and oven, they're all made of Nila brands. And as you can see, there are plenty of kitchen island top for you to do the preparation of your food, plenty of spaces for you to put your kitchen appliances, and you also have a very nice washing area as well. And by now, you may be wondering where the fridge and freezer is. You don't see it anywhere here. And actually, the fridge and freezer is actually nicely concealed. You can see this is the fridge and the freezer is over here. This is what I love about small apartments like this because the bulky items are always nicely concealed and it saves up a lot of space which gives you a lot of utilizable space as well. So this kitchen currently is an open concept kitchen and you can enclose it by installing maybe a glass sliding door over here and also putting a glass door over there as well. No problem, right? This is how you can enclose the kitchen. And one thing I have to show you is the entrance foyer. It's important to show you the entrance foyer because you may be wondering where the shoe cabinets are. And what the owners have done is that they've installed four panels of shoe cabinets that is more than enough for you and they have placed a very luxurious marble laminate over here with LED light strips that illuminate this space where you can put some accessories or display some family portraits as well. And directly linking the kitchen is actually where the main dining area of the property is. And as you can see, this dining area here currently can fit a family of three because this family is a family of three. But let's say if you want to fit one more chair, I don't think that's a problem at all. Let's take a look at how the living hall of this property looks like. Let's go. All right, so welcome to the main living hall of this property. But before I bring you through this living hall, I just want to bring you a little bit more of the orientation of this entire space. So to my left, we have the balcony. And right in front of me, we have the first bedroom of the property as well as the common bathroom. And you may be wondering where the master bedroom is. I'm going to bring you that surprise later on. So stay tuned to find out. This living hall here, as you can see, is amazing. I really like the feature wall over here because it's really spectacular and it really exudes the modern luxury theme of this entire property, coupled with the design lighting up top. This is amazing. Very, very amazing feature here. And as you can see, this feature wall here, what the owners have done is that they have installed LED light strips all around the feature wall. And I love it because the light reflects off the marble laminate that's installed by the owners. And despite it being aesthetically pleasing, it is actually very functional. We have four panels of cabinetry spaces, as well as six panels over here that is installed by the owner to act as storage space as well. This feature wall here is amazing, isn't it? So this living hall here, as you can see, you are very surprised because you may be wondering, in a 732 square foot apartment, it is supposed to be very, very small. But as you can see, this space here is very spacious. And not only that, we have a couch that can fit up to four individuals. I love this living hall here because it's really cozy. Okay, let's take a look at how the balcony looks like. Let's go. Alright, so welcome to the balcony of this property. This space here is amazing, not only because of the space, but the view as well, right? We have an unblocked view over here that ensures that this balcony space here is very windy. And right here is actually northeast facing, which means that you don't have afternoon sun nor morning sun. What the owners have done is they've installed a fan here so that if you just want to have some alfresco dining, you can do so as well. This space here is very adequate, you can see, because what the owners have done is that they actually have placed some outdoor furniture here for you to enjoy the view, have a cup of coffee, kickstart your day, or just read a book. And this space here has also enough space for you to put plants as well. All right, let's take a look at how the common bathroom of this property looks like. As you can see, this common bathroom here looks amazing and it's also very functional as well. We have a toilet bowl here. We also have a very small washing area here. So for those families out there who have small kids, I think you will appreciate this. 
and the owners have also installed cabinetry spaces behind this mirror and there are also cabinetry spaces below the washing area as well so plenty of storage areas for you let's take a look at how the first bedroom of this property looks like let's go Alright, so welcome to the first bedroom of this property and as you can see, this bedroom here is very loving because the owners have selected all the items for their baby daughters. So for families out there who has a daughter, you will appreciate this space here. But what I like about this room here is that it's extremely functional as well and very sizable. So let's say if you want to put a queen size bed, you can do so as well. So the owners have placed a baby cot here as well as two separate drawers that acts as storage spaces for the kids' toys and diapers. This already shows you how utilizable this space is. And this entire space is illuminated by two down lights as well as three design lightings and LED light strips that's right in front of me. And what I love about this space here is that the owners also have installed a Murphy bed here that can be pulled out anytime if they want to rest with their baby. And the owners have dug up this space into a work area so that they can do some work while mending their baby. So you can see that some fixtures installed by the owner includes this L-shaped work table here. There are plenty of cabinetry spaces installed by the owners as well as shelves as well. This chair here can roam around freely in this room because the owners have installed vinyl flooring which is very easy to upkeep and maintain. Let's take a look at the mysterious master bedroom. Let's go! So for those who have watched the video till now, you are in for a treat. You may be wondering where the mysterious master bedroom is, am I right? Here you go. Welcome to the world of Narnia. <laughs> Alright, so welcome to the highlight of this place and that is the master bedroom. And it's so interesting to see a door like this that also has shelving spaces here for you to put some family portraits as well. So cool, right? This master bedroom, as you can see, the owners have spent quite a lot in the renovation. So all of these building wardrobes, the owners actually have torn down the original ones and built it themselves. And as you can see, this area here is so luxurious, right? The bed rest is so nice. The gold tinge of the bed rest really exudes the entire modern luxury theme of this entire apartment. You have the LED light strips that's right behind the feature wall that's done behind the bed. And all of these artificial plants here really make it seem like we are in the Garden of Eden. It's so interesting. There are also two bedside tables here, which the owners also have placed two lamps and also where they charge their phones as well. And right above, we have four down lights and one very beautiful design lighting that illuminates this entire master bedroom. And on the other side of the master bedroom, right below the bedside table, the owners also have customized a very, very cool looking digital safe. So interesting, right? And this is the northeast facing, which means that you don't have to worry about the afternoon sun nor the morning sun, which means that you can go deep into your slumber during the weekends. And do you know what I really love about this master bedroom here? Is that even though it's aesthetically pleasing, it is super functional. All of this are cabinetry spaces with leather laminate. Yes, it's leather laminate and so interesting. And all of these are storage spaces for the owners as well. This is what I mean by balancing aesthetics as well as functionality. Let's take a look at how the master bathroom looks like. I hope you are still watching this video and welcome to the master bathroom. So the master bathroom is separated from the master bedroom area via this very nice wooden sliding door. And if I have not mentioned, all the doors here are actually painted black by the owners, right? So this master bathroom, as you can see, is really luxurious. I really like how the LED strips below actually illuminates this space here. And the owners also have installed storage spaces right behind the mirrors as well. And what I really love about this master bathroom is that the showering area is separated from the main bathroom area that prevents, you know, water from splashing out. And this place here is huge. You can fit up to two individuals. You have a rain shower here. And this really ensures that your entire showering experience is so comfortable, especially after a long day at work. I finished this home tour. Let's go back to the living hall. Let's go. So 6 Debeshire is a freehold condominium along the Bishire Road and is located opposite United Square and very close to Novena MRT. It is a 168-unit development in a 30-storey residential building and the first four levels are multi-storey car parks. The swimming pool is located above the car park. The close proximity to United Square and Novena MRT makes this a very good proposition if you are looking for a condominium which is close to amenities and transportation. The mall has a cold storage supermarket as well as many eateries. 
There are many good schools in the vicinity, such as St. Joseph Institution Junior. In fact, if you drive home to Sixth Abishaya, you will pass by the entrance of SJI Junior before reaching your home. Some other reputable schools include Anglo Chinese School Junior, which is just less than a km away, Anglo Chinese School Primary, which is about 1.2 km away, and St. Margaret's Primary School. Another amazing factor is the smart home concept. Sixth Abishai is one of the first condominiums in Singapore to integrate a smart home system into every home. It adds a layer of convenience to the homeowners and tenants, and you can do things like make bookings for the barbecue pit via the smartphone app. If you have guests arriving, you can pre-register them via their car plate number, and when they reach the condominium, the camera at the guardhouse will recognize their car plate number and let them in automatically. Sixth Debishaya is also extremely close to Novina Medical Center, and Novina is slowly but surely transforming into a medical hub. From Sixth Debishaya, it would take you about two minutes to walk to Novina MRT station. It is extremely close to the train station. The next MRT stop would be Newton MRT station, then Orchard MRT station. If you drive, it would take you about five to 10 minutes to get to Orchard Road. You are extremely close to the CBD, and it only takes you just 10 minutes there. Hi! Does it feel a bit odd that I'm the only one here in this video? I hope you don't feel so. But anyways, thank you so much for watching this entire video. Okay, I'm gonna go through what I like about this property, okay? So in all seriousness, I feel that the owners have done a great job in designing this 732 square foot apartment. It is so functional, there's so many storage spaces here. So whoever says that you need a storage room, you don't need that, you don't need a bomb shelter because the owners have installed so many cabinetries and cabinet spaces all around. And I really love the Nanya theme door to the master bedroom. It's like so mysterious, right? If you like that, please comment down below, okay? And what I love about this apartment is also the balcony space that overlooks the unlocked greenery view right in front of this apartment. Thank you so much for watching this episode of the JNL Lock series. If you love this video, remember to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and also leave us some positive comments. And most importantly, if you love this unit, remember to give our listing manager a call. Thank you so much for watching yet an episode of JNL Unlocked. You have a master view, am I right? Di dong, di dong. Okay, but in all seriousness, I really, really cool toe, cool toe. But anyways, I really be to be honest. Seven hundred thirty-three. Oh my god. Where's that? After this, I'm like.